Now to the guests, look around. This is a pretty intimate setting with a short guest list. Aren't you happy you made the cut? <laughs> you are here today because you are the most important people in all the world to Alex and Iris. Out of the eight billion people on the planet, you were chosen to witness this special day. Iris has a hard time making decisions, but then there is a decision to get together with Alex. And that was one of the decisions that came so quickly to her. She was confident, and this is one of the first times I saw her with such conviction. It's incredible to be here witnessing the start of Alex and Iris's lifelong adventure together. You guys are their A-list friends. So I hope you party accordingly. <laughs> Iris, from the very first day we met, you have had the gift of gravity pulling me in towards you. You give my life substance and weight. And at the same time, with a smile, a hug, a laugh, you can make me feel weightless, lifting all my stresses and worries in an instant. For much of my life, my heart has felt like a piece of driftwood tossed around in rough seas. So I built an iron ship around that wooden heart and kept it safely behind locked doors. But with you, I feel completely free. Like that piece of driftwood finally found a home upon dry land. So as Alex's favorite brother, I'm honored that he would trust me to share exactly how I feel about him in front of his most beloved friends and family. If I could distill who Alex was down into one quality, it would be exactly that, that above all, he values the importance of family and friends. Alex, you are the love of my life, my best friend, and my forever adventure buddy. Since the first day we met, I felt a special connection between us. Even with every curveball life threw at us, we always found a way back to each other and I always knew you were the man I wanted to spend the rest of my life with. I'm kind of nervous. Turn around? Yeah. Oh my goodness. I you like your tie. Oh, thanks. I love you so much. I will have to bore you though with a story because I have some unfinished business with my nephew. This story speaks to a young man's character. When Yukio first got hired on at Deloitte, he pulls out this envelope and he tells me, Uncle, I got my first bonus from Deloitte. I want you to have it. This envelope goes back and forth and I finally take it. But when I took it, I told myself, when he gets married, I'm going to give it back to him. And so here you go, Alex. I'm going to request one thing from you. That that money, it is to be spent on frivolous things like spas, rounds of golf, salsa cigar bars. There's going to be plenty of time for wise investments. This is for the opposite. Now, I could have done this in private with him, but I wanted you all to know how thoughtful, caring, and deep my nephew is at the age of 24.
love you forever and always, to be the hand you have to hold as we grow old. I promise to always root for you and to root for your Dodgers and Raiders <laughs> and be your biggest fan. I promise to cherish you and our marriage for the rest of our lives. Today and forever, I give you my heart. remember, eat together, drink together, explore together, love each other, and when time gets hard, remember tonight. I love you guys. And when it's time for the cousin of sleep to finally take us, not even death will part me from you. I promise to meet you at the crossroads between this world and the next. And with your hand in mine, I will be the one you have to walk into the light.